How's it going everybody? My name is Red Ed and welcome back to Stardew Valley. We are on day two of our new adventure and our new life out in Stardew Valley. So we're gonna check the weather, first of all. It's going to rain all day tomorrow. That's good because that means we won't have to water our crops, which leaves us more time to do other stuff. Spirits are very happy today. They will do their best to shore everyone with your with their fortune. Okay. Yeah, that's good. Alright, ooh, we got a message. What's up? Hello there, just got back from a fishing trip. You should come down to the beach sometime. I've got something for you. Willy. Well, Willy, you'll be seeing me in no time. So we're gonna put this down here. I've learned from my first playthrough um, that it's a good idea to save at least one of each thing that you find, especially um, things that you find out and about, so dandelions, daffodils, uh, leeks, and other things, because those are seasonal. That means that I won't find these in the summer, for example, or in any other season except for spring. So you want to keep those, um, that way you'll always have them, and you'll find out eventually, you'll see why it's a good idea to keep them. You can also eventually upgrade all the tools that you have. It's very much like Minecraft, where um, you can you can get gold versions of them, you can get copper versions of them. I think steel versions, and then there's some uh, some other mineral that I get is the equivalent of diamond in Minecraft. But you can't have diamond things in here. I'm gonna fill this up, put it back in the box, even though I probably shouldn't have done that because that's just wasted energy. And doo -doo -doo. yeah, I think we are good. I'm just gonna go. You know what? I'm gonna, no, I, I won't take that. But I'm just gonna go down to the. Put got nothing. I, I'm I'm dumb. We're gonna go down to the beach and meet Willy. And actually, I'm gonna check this area here for flowers. Nope, nothing there. What is that? I never even saw that. Out of order. Great. Alright, so we're gonna go down here. Go, oh, whoa, 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 the little thingy is exploding there. Oh, okay. Well, I know that. I gotta visit the beach before 5 p.m. We got it. It's really early. I should have probably used some of that time to, like, chop down some trees or something. Hello, hello, who are you? What, what do you want? Go away. Oh, fuck you. He's the worst. So not friendly at all. Okay, so we're gonna go down here, beach is all the way down to the southeast area. There's, this place is really big, there's a, it, it looks small, but it takes time to get from one place to the other. Oh. Hello. Ahoy there, son. Ahoy to you! Heard there was a newcomer in town, good to finally meet you. Same. Ah, I'm still trying to unwind from a month out on the salty seas. It was a big haul. I sold a lot of good fish. Finally saved enough to buy me a new rod. And guess what? Here, I want you to have my old fishing rod. It's important to me that the art of fishing stays alive. And hey, maybe you'll buy something from the shop once in a while. You bet I will, because you know I'll have to. Yay, we got a new bamboo pole. Well, a used bamboo pole. It doesn't matter, though. It's good, because we didn't have one. There's good water here in the valley. All kinds of fish. Oh yeah, my shop's back open now, so come by if you need supplies. I'll also buy anything you catch. If it smells, it sells. <laughs> That's what my old pappy used to say, anyway. Oh. And together, they gazed upon the vastness of the ocean. And then he just left by. Okay, I'm gonna do some fishing. Cause fishing is pretty sweet. That was surprisingly fast. So, you can read, I can't, but um, the point is to keep that bar behind the fish until the bar, oh my god, I'm sucking so bad, until the bar on the right is all the way up top. Two inch long sardine. Wow. What a haul. Alright, but um, 
Fish is good because, um, oh, this is not fish. Because you can sell it for quite a lot of money, especially in the beginning, it's good to just kind of like, I, me personally, I like to just sell every, most of what I make and find. Um, because it helps, that way you can make money. Ooh, we got a little treasure. Sweet. Let's see what we find in that. Oh, come here, come here, fishy, come here. Oh my god. Fish, fish, fish. Stop. Stop, where are you? Fish. Come on. Oh my god. Uh, really? A one inch long sardine? Uh, ooh, we got a geode and coal. That's a pretty good thing. It's a pretty good treasure chest. So we're gonna go. I'm gonna take the geode to. Oh, wait, I don't have money. Oh, I can sell the fish that I, that I fish here. So that I have money to uh, have the blacksmith crack open the geode, and hopefully we'll find something cool in it. You can find you can find all sorts of stuff. Sometimes minerals. Sometimes it's just stone. Sometimes it's like more fish. No, I'm just kidding. It's not. Although I don't know. Maybe I wouldn't put it past this game. Hell yeah, five-inch long sardine. You know it. Wait, that was, that was a shitty throw. I'm not sure what maxing out a throw, or cast, I guess, actually does to, I guess, the, your fishing results. I don't know if it gives you better fish, or if it makes it easier to reel in the fish. I don't, I'm not sure. Okay, well, I'm done with stupid sardines. Ooh, yes, that's what I was looking for. The bubbles. If you... That did not work out nearly as well as I was hoping it would. But uh, if you see bubbles, though, that means that there's fish uh, nearby. So you want to toss your uh, your your line right into it, and generally it just makes it so that you you um, you find more fish much faster than usual. Ooh, another chest. We're killing it today. I swear to God, if this is another freaking sardine. I'm gonna be mad. Stop going up and down. You're a fish, not a submarine. There we go. Oh, god damn it. Hopefully we got something cool. Another two geos and two more coal. Well, I'll I'll gladly take that. Okay, I'm gonna do one more. Uh, I'm gonna fish until like I don't know. A little while longer. Maybe catch another couple fish because we have five so far. I'm just gonna, I don't wanna waste all my time fishing here because that's probably not too entertaining for you guys, but I'm gonna sell this stuff, 296. That's fine by me. And plus we can fish anywhere else. There's a lot of other areas that we can fish. We can fish in the river up here. We can fish up in this lake. We can fish in this one. Uh, not in this one. I tried fishing in that. All I got was trash. So. Okay, ooh, we can get all this stuff. Ooh, these these are good too. These sell for a decent amount of money as well. Oh, and there's this. No, that's. But, you know what? Fuck it. Well, I'm I'm gonna fish. I don't care. Maybe I'll fish something great and awesome. Oh shit! I actually got something. <laughs> and I got a treasure chest. Oh, this is great. Oh god, oh god. I'm not sure if... I'm guessing you probably wouldn't catch. You would lose the chest, too, if you lost the fish. But, I don't know, I've always managed to get both. And I'm not gonna try and fail just to... Ooh, we got an anchovy. And? Alright, mixed, se mixed seeds, coal, and bait. We can't use bait yet, but, um, this... Oh my god, stop doing that. Okay, this... Oh! <laughs> Can you... There we go. Hmm, with 300 pieces of wood, this could be fixed, and I'm gonna try and do that probably in the next episode, maybe not tomorrow, because this right here, you can harvest, and there's a whole bunch of other stuff there that sells for a pretty decent amount of money. So it's definitely worth worth the investment, especially earlier in the game where when you're struggling to make ends meet. So let's sell him all this good stuff. Um 
eh, you know what? Take that too, because I don't, I really don't need it. So, there's um, you'll we'll get an upgrade eventually that will allow us to put bait on the on the hook, and that just it makes fish uh, bite faster, which is good. It's definitely a good thing to have, but we can't use it yet. So, what am I going to do about it? Okay, can we? We've already met these guys. How are we doing? On introductions, 19 out of 28. Wait, have I met this guy? God, stop! <laughs> uh, he just loves fishing, doesn't he? Hello. Mm. It's irritating to have to meet all these new people, huh? Name's George, by the way. Now buzz off. Mm. Guess we we hadn't we hadn't met him, and he probably would have liked it that way. So, ooh, we got bread. I know it's maybe a little bit frowned upon, but. Do remember to check other people's trash because you can find some good stuff in it. Like bread just now, you can find. Um, sometimes you just find trash, granted, but just make sure that nobody sees you do it because if they do, they'll like scold you. And I don't know if that affects your relationship with them, but I'm guessing it might. I'm guessing you might lose um, some of the hearts that you've gotten. Speaking of which. I want to check on something. So, this is this keeps tracks of how many gifts you give into a person in a week. So right now it's Tuesday. Um, I have until Sunday, uh, until Saturday. Sorry, because the week starts on Sunday. So I have until Saturday to give these people. Well, no, I can give these people another gift in like two weeks from now, I believe. But um, you can only give two gifts to each person every week, no more than two gifts, and no more than one gift per day. And I believe, depending on the gift, if the gift is good enough, it'll add a heart on here. So you want to find out what some people might like better. Um, some people don't like flowers, like uh, what's her name earlier, she hated the flower that I gave her, whereas some other people will love them. So it's a matter of just getting to learn, getting to know these characters. I'm just gonna be weird and go in here, just talk to you guys, because this, this is a lot of people that I haven't met, I don't think. Wait, no, I met you. You're, she's the one that hated my, my flower. Who are you? Lee Robin. My arms are strong, but my legs need work. Don't look, I'm all red and sweaty. Exercising can be fun. Barney smiles at you through a mist of sweat. <laughs> a mist of sweat. Alright, well, bye, ladies. You do you, and I'm gonna buy some more stuff. That's a lot of, that's, that's a pretty good amount of money, but I'm not gonna sell that, I'm gonna save it. And I wanna buy, I'm gonna buy one, two, three more of these so I can even it out, and it's not gonna bug me. We have 400, um, I'm gonna buy some kale. I'm gonna buy as much kale as I can get. Five? That's good by me. And let's head on to the blacksmith. F crap. Shoot, I don't have enough money. Never mind. Never mind. So about that that whole that whole thing where I was not gonna sell bread. Change my mind, because that way I can open all the geodes, because it costs uh, 25 gold to open a geode, so I didn't have enough money for that. I only had 56, so that would have only allowed me to open two. And I don't want that. Oh, you know what? I'm gonna give you another gift. Because I like you. I'm tutoring Vincent and Joss today. They're a handful, but it's nice to make a difference in someone's life. You deserve it. Thank you. This looks special. So now, she got two gifts. So I can't give her any more gifts until next week. That's uh, Sunday morning is when it resets. Uh, I can't go in there. I mean, I can, but I have no reason to because this is the blacksmith. Ah! I'd hope it closes at four. We're gonna go there tomorrow. I'm gonna go home. I'm gonna plant these things, and I'm going to um, chop down some wood with the last of the energy that I have, so that hopefully, maybe tomorrow we can get, uh, we can open the bridge by the beach and, you know, explore that area. Also. If I remember it right, tomorrow is supposed to be raining. 
So if that's the case, we won't have to do any of this farming nonsense, and um, I might just go down and just fish the whole day, or most of the day at least. Okay, so we can... Oh, I don't need to put it away because I own... I'll take that, take that, take that. Can I eat any of these things? I might need some sustenance. I'll just have that, I guess. And... Yeah, that's good. Okay, we have these. I'm gonna hoe this down a bit. Boom. Boom. Wait, I forgot. I forgot the damn watering can. Go back. Take that. Wait. I knew why I wanted to drop off some of these things. It's because I'm gonna need um room for all the wood and stone that I find. Wait, no. Take that. Okay. Okay, and we're gonna do another row of five for my kale. And screw it. No. There. Uh, you can undo this, by the way, by hitting it with a pickaxe. If uh, if you don't if you don't want to have uneven cloths, which I know I don't want to have it. Damn it! I messed up. I meant to put <laughs> I meant to do kale over here and the seeds over there, but uh, that's all right. Okay, let's water this. What time is it? 6.50. It's getting a little late, but should be okay. All right. Watering is done. Drop that in there. Um, I could eat this, but I want to save it because I'm... they're pretty pretty hard to come by, so... Okay, let's see that. Hopefully it'll give me some energy. It's pretty good. All right. Well, let's chop down some trees. I don't know if I don't know that I'll be able to do it to get to 300 tonight. In fact, I'm pretty positive I won't be able to because I think each tree gives you about 20 something wood. Let's see. Yeah. 17. I've seen some that gave me 21, but it's it's in that in that range. So, I would have to chop down quite a few trees to get to the 300 that I need. But, once again, we don't have anything else to do, so until I'm about to pass out, I'm gonna do this, which is probably gonna happen, like, right now. That's that's the end of that. How much should we get? 53. Yeah, it could have been worse. Okay, so do we have anything that we can put in the box? Do, 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 do. We do not. And we're gonna go to sleep. Yay, level 1 fishing, plus 1 fishing rod proficiency. And level 1 foraging, plus 1 axe proficiency tree sometimes drops seeds, new crafting recipe wild seeds, and new crafting recipe field snack. That's really good. So yeah, like I said, just doing those basic tasks will automatically increase your levels. Welcome back to Worldwick's Oracle. If you seek hidden knowledge of the future, well, you've come to the right place. The spirits feel neutral today. The bay is in your hands. Well, that's good because I plan on going fishing, and I don't want them to be against me. That way we can get more fish. Okay, so, real quick, get out of my way. Everybody get out of my way. Okay, uh, let's do these. Get this tree down. Nope, there we go. Um, and I'm thinking as long as I can have... Uh, probably about one third of my energy before I go to the beach. I should be okay because I can always eat the fish to replenish that. So I might have to eat the first few fish that I get, but. Okay. Oh, come on. Stupid. Stupid. So stupid. Okay. Also, if we're lucky. We got an acorn already. If we're lucky, we're gonna get some more seeds because one of the recipes we got is for a field snack. And one acorn, one maple seed, and one pine cone makes a field snack, and that gives us quite a lot of energy. So I'm gonna try and get some pine cones out of these pine trees. Hopefully that will happen. Right? Nice, we got two. Sweet. Okay, and then. Can you there we go. And I'm gonna try and get some 
maple seeds. I'm not sure. Well, I'm not sure which is the maple, to be completely honest with you. How are we doing on wood? 75. That's decent. But once again, now we have one, two, three, so we can make field snacks. I'm gonna make... I can make two. Okay, and I still have one acorn, so if we can get more... Um, what's it called? More maple seeds, which we just got one of, and uh, more uh, pine cones. We'll be able to have even more field snacks. And I'm fine with uh, using these seeds to make those, honestly, because I... It's for the greater good. It's for the greater good. Okay, I need I need more pine trees though. Let's go down here. This seems to be the pine tree central. Holy crap, there's a lot of butterflies flying out of the tree. I'm sorry, little guys. I just need to be doing this. You know you know what I mean? Alright, we're gonna make more of these. Three. Cool. Uh okay. Let's get out of my way. 138 wood. I'm tempted to to chop down more, but I don't wanna I don't wanna waste all my energy on that. So we're gonna put this away. We're gonna put this away. Um, I'm gonna plant these two. Put this away. This this and we're gonna sell this, and we're gonna bring this with us so we can get it opened. And the field snacks. Okay. Let me just really quick. Till some more of this, put these down, and off we go. Off we go to I am not entirely sure where. Where are we going? I don't really have anything that I have to do. Uh, except for, how are we doing on introductions? Nope, not that one. 21 out of 28. Okay. Um, I don't know that we'll find everybody today, but... I'm certainly down to try. I don't think that we will. Here, let's see. Since we're here. Let's see who lives in here. Uh, I've met you guys, haven't I? You're Jody. Yep. Did I wipe my boots? I did it. Nobody tell her. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna go and get my geodes cracked open. And then... 12, 10 p.m., so that's good. We still have quite a lot of time. And then I'm going to go down to... Um, I think in the beach, maybe? And do some fishing there. And then we're going to use that money to buy some more seeds. Uh, to, 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 to process geos. There we go. Ooh, what's that? Is that a cucumber? Petrified slime. A earth crystal. Coal, cool, and ooh, ooh, that's pretty. A Nikoite. Thank you. Wait, can I sell it to you? I mean, I know I can, but is it worth it? 80, 50, ooh, 120. I don't know what this does. But it's a pretty good amount of money, so I'm gonna sell it. I'm gonna sell this one too. I'm gonna save this one because I know it's a... What? I know it's a... It makes for a good gift. For a good gift. For a good gift. Um, so I'm gonna save that one for right now. And actually I wanna go see if I can find some people to gift. Because I wanna gift... Um, I wanna get, I wanna start building relationships with some of the bachelorettes. I guess because it's good you know, not necessarily just so I can start a relationship with them and whatnot, but because it's good to have um, have friends, have people that you're like close to, and you guys will see eventually why. Okay, you already got all the gifts that you need this week, so no more for you. But I do want to meet um, Abigail, who is one of the bachelorettes, and is also one of the pe people that we haven't met yet. Ah, oh, damn it, you're closed on Wednesday because you're the worst. Looking for a handsome young man to bring me a herring, Haley. Okay, well, we have a quest. So, let's see if we can do that. Oh, God, I'm gonna, I'm gonna ch chow down a little bit first. Chomp, chomp, chomp. Delish. Yeah, it gives us quite a, quite a bit of energy, so that's, that's good. Eat all of it. I don't care. Sweet. Okay. I'm not sure where uh, 
anybody is, but I guess why would they be out and about? It's raining. So I'm gonna go to the beach, because that's where herrings can be fished. Just checking for any kind of seashells and whatnot, but I don't see any, so never mind. Just gonna make our way, you know what? There we go. That looks neat. Hello, guy. I don't think I met you. The ocean is best enjoyed alone, don't you think? Point taken. But I'm still gonna be fishing right here if you don't mind. Thank you. Because, you know. Are those? I can't tell. Yeah, those are bubbles. Hold up, hold up, hold up. I'm gonna go to those bubbles. Oh, they're gone. Damn it, Shane. It's all your fault. I could have been the very best. But you hold me back. He's such an emo kid. Look at him. Standing in the rain, looking at the ocean. Oh, why? I don't need your seaweed. Well, actually, I could always use it, because you can eat it, so... Please tell me it's a herring. Oh, come back. Oh, 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 okay. Oh. Perfect. Nope. Stupid sardines. No, stop. Okay, whatever. Apparently, um... People have been saying that you get better fish the farther away you are from the beach, or from the shore, I guess. Um, but it hasn't really been confirmed, but I've been trying... There's these weird sounds in the background. I don't know if you guys can hear them. I'll try to amplify it once I get to editing this video, but they're really creepy. It sounds like some ghosts kind of like ooing in the background all mysterious like can we get a herring like why is this why is this so hard when i eat some of this seaweed yes you'll eat anything he doesn't care he knows he gotta live off the land oh that was that was fast oh i can already tell you this is going to be an eel and you can tell because it just jumps up and down. Or at least in my experience, every single eel I found so far in the game has done this. Which kind of makes sense, because eels are all like swirly. Told ya. Alright, cool. We got that. That does sell for quite a little bit of money. Especially compared to, you know, sardines and anchovies. Wait, what happened to my anchovy? Did I put it in the box? I think I put it in the box, didn't I? So dumb. Oh. Well. I guess we're not selling the fish to the guy right now, because he just peaced out. Yeah. This one closes at 5, too. Just something to keep in mind, because you don't want to... If you're trying to sell things on the day of, you, you want to do that before the stores close, obviously. But it's okay. I'll just put it in the box and we'll still get money tomorrow. So it's all good. And I can still probably grab a few extra seeds from the general store. So I'm going to do this one more. I'm going to catch one more fish. Hopefully it will be a herring. Herrings do live in the ocean, right? They're a saltwater fish. I don't know. That's what I'm talking about. Did you, you, you heard that, right? I wob. There's these weird sounds in the background. They only happen when, when it rains, though. Not when it's sunny. And I have no idea. Ooh, yes. Give me that treasure. Oh! Damn it! Did I get... Oh, well, that answers my question. Can you get a treasure if you miss the fish? You cannot. Alright. Well, I'm gonna head out. So that didn't work out. Let's see if we can find some more people to meet. But I didn't see them. Okay, I know that one of them tends to be here. No, nope, they are not. Okay. I don't think we've been up here yet. So let's go let's go make our way up here. I mean we have been here, just not over over to the other side. Over here. So let's go explore this area up north. Ooh, a daffodil. Take that with you. 
There's mushrooms too. I don't know if you guys still here. I'll show you again. There's mushrooms right here, but I can't access that area. I'm not sure how I can get to it. Can I, can I go in here? Meet some of the folks. Uh, wait. You should also give gifts to people, uh, even though they're married, because no, giving gifts is not just so you can get married to them, obviously. Greetings, I'm Demetrius, local scientist and father. Thanks for introducing yourself. Nice to meet you too, Demetrius. I'm studying the local plants and animals from my home laboratory. Have you met my daughter, Maru? She's interested to meet you. Hey now. But I have met your daughter, Maru, haven't I? I believe I, 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 I have. Good. Okay. Well, bye guys. You guys have a really nice house, by the way. What? Sebastian? Who the hell is Sebastian? Oh, is he the, the, the emo kid? I didn't even know there was a room in here. I thought that was just the way the house was constructed. Nor did I know that he was their son. Oh, yeah. We have... What's his name in here? I don't know. Let's see if he's in here. He is... Hello, guy. A stranger. Hello. Hello to you, too. Don't mind me. I just live out here alone. Well, carry on, then. You got a pretty sweet setup here. Your thing looks like a bean. Okay. Well, you enjoy your time out in the woods in your yellow tent. And I will head on home. And uh, we don't have anything to do, really. We don't have it. Oh, give me that. Give me that leak. Leaks are fairly rare, and that one up there seems to be the main area where they where they um, spawn. So, like I said, there's reasons why you'd want to keep one or two of each um, item that you find uh, scattered around because it's they they don't come out in other seasons. Wait, I'm gonna take these. But no, wait, what? What did I get? Why did I just pick up? I don't know. But I want to take these two. That way I can... If I get more seeds, um, I can make more... Uh, what are they called? What, what, is it? what is that? What is that? Field snacks. There we go. I still have time to chop down a bunch of trees. That way, in the next episode, we can go and um, repair the bridge down by the beach. And I can show you guys that area. I mean, it's not very much, but like I said, it's definitely worth the investment. Oh shoot, it's midnight and I'm still up and I'm a fuck up. It's alright though, so we got enough to make field snacks, so if anything we can just eat that tomorrow morning and um, get some extra energy, I guess. Okie dokie, let's get into bed, our walk-in bed. Yes, do go to sleep. Let's see, let's see if we got any good money. Oh, that's pretty good. Alright. Cool. Well, I think I think that's it. I don't think we can get any more. Alright. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed the episode. And if you did, as always, please let me know in the comments. And I will see you next time for more Stardew Valley. Bye-bye.